day kind of walkabout uh, to looking for his father who he found or understood to have been sold south. Uh, Nat does not recall or recite being beat upon his return and it would be highly unusual for a slave to leave for 30 days. Uh, uh, but I have no doubt that he did. Uh, and we're going to go on this road for about three miles. So we got a, we got a while. But Nat will later say that when I got large enough to go to work, presumably at 10, 11, or 12 years old, while employed, I was reflecting on many things that would present themselves to my imagination. And whenever an opportunity to occur to looking at a book, when the school kids were getting their lessons, I would find many things that the fertility of my own imagination had depicted to me all in my time, not devoted to my master's service, was spent either in prayer or in making experiments and casting different things in molds made of earth and attempting to make paper, gunpowder, and many other experiments that although I could not perfect, yet, yet convinced me of the practicality if I'd had the means. I was not addicted to stealing my youth, nor have I ever been, yet such was the confidence of the Negroes in the neighborhood, even at this early period in my life, in my superior judgment, that they would often carry me with them when they were going on any kind of roguery to plan for them. And in growing up among them, with this confidence in my superior judgment, I would remove myself from their company. And here is my dad's language. Uh, the, 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 the